this paper, we propose Deep Inertial Poser, a novel deep learning-based approach capable of reconstructing full human body pose from just six IMUs worn on the user's body in real time. Mapping from sparse IMU signals to pose parameters is a difficult and severely under-constrained problem. To illustrate this, consider a series of leg raises. In this example, many orientations of the upper leg can result in the same IMU measurements on the lower leg. Hence, inferring the upper leg's orientation from the lower leg alone is ambiguous. In prior work, von Markhardt and others addressed this problem by optimizing for orientations and accelerations over the entire sequence. While presenting impressive results, SIP is an offline approach which limits its applicability. Instead, we propose to learn this mapping from data. In particular, we leverage synthetic training data, generated by placing virtual sensors onto the lower extremities of a simple mesh, reconstructed from motion capture datasets. We train a recurrent neural network on this data to predict the pose parameters of the whole human body as outputs. We leverage a bidirectional RNN that has access to the entire sequence at training time. At test time, our approach supports two regimes. In offline mode, the network has access to the whole sequence, resulting in high quality but at the cost of offline processing. In online mode, we feed a sliding window of inputs to the model, allowing for real-time inference. We found that just five future frames is sufficient to produce good predictions. Here, we show results from a three-way comparison between our model, SOP, and SIP on three datasets. Playground by von Markhardt and others. Total Capture by Trumbull and others and DIP IMU, a dataset which we recorded. We are publishing this dataset alongside this work. Our method achieves similar levels of accuracy compared to SIP, but is many orders of magnitude faster than the baseline and runs in real time. This sequence shows a failure case where both the baselines and our model struggle to accurately reconstruct the leg raise. Note that this is a challenging motion due to the ambiguity in the orientation measurements. Nonetheless, our model is sometimes capable of faithfully reconstructing the most challenging poses, even when SIP and SOP baselines fail. Here we show a result from the fine-tuned model on a held-out sequence of DIP-IMU. Note how our model rarely produces interpenetrations and is capable of producing smooth outputs despite some noise in the input. Lastly, we show results from our live demo. Note that we feed the IMU data directly into the model and do not apply any temporal smoothing on the resulting predictions. In contrast to most vision-based methods, DIP can accurately capture limb orientation, which is an important aspect in many application scenarios such as character animation. Here, we demonstrate results from a series of arm movements, such as swings, crossings behind the head. Crossings on the torso. And when rotating the upper body. Leg movements are also captured faithfully, such as when walking, sitting down, or sidestepping.
Here we show results from faster motions such as jumping jacks. Or a baseball swing. As our setup requires only few IMU sensors, it is unobtrusive and can be used when interacting with other objects. Or humans. Thank you for watching.